And welcome to the MBS Show, episode number 383. <laughs> uh, I am your host, Norman Sanzo. And well, this week we have a pretty interesting episode. So let's not dilly daddy and let's hop right into it. So, first news for this week is uh, Rare Twilight Sparkle Finship is Magic Comic number Issue number 1. Uh, comics. <laughs> what am I even reading here? Um, the Finship is Magic Rare Cover uh, featuring Twilight sold for about a thousand and twenty-five dollars. <coughs> so, what's the story behind this? Well, it seems that the artist Sarah Richard um, auctioned off the comic on eBay, and s- I-, I guess there was a battle. And <laughs> the bidding war got up to a thousand and twenty five dollars, which is extremely high. Woo! And it includes ten percent uh, sorry, it includes ten dollar shipping. Oh you would have thought that a thousand twenty five you get free shipping. No, no. So yeah, um this is one of those few rare covers that <coughs> are hard to get. And it seems that it's out there. Like this is one of the uh, what I think uh, Finship I think Finship is 5 was it? yeah one of the 5 alternate covers and this was the um, what was they called the the Spanish holiday Day of the Dead something like that so yeah this this was really out there and uh, this version of the comic was signed so that's cool too <coughs> but don't worry boys and girls uh, if you miss out on the first one, you can always try the second one. Uh, not sold by Sarah Richards, uh, fortunately, but the comic is out there. And the bidding starts at 99 cents. So let's see where this goes. <coughs> oh my god. <coughs> oh my. So it's up to um, $530. Mm. Yes, uh, that is pretty extreme. Five hundred and thirty dollars with twenty one bits. Oh my goodness. I wonder um can we see how much the bit went? Oh yeah. Oh wow, it jumped up to fifty. No no <laughs> nobody's playing. Like they, they want it bad. Alright. So yeah. Um if you're a big fan and really want something awesome to collect, I I, I guess this one's uh, one of them. And let's move on to the next news. Ah, <laughs> alright. Equestria Daily now supports dark mode. <coughs> so, I'm, I'm guessing you probably noticed the layout of Equestria Daily being a bit darker. Yes. And that's because, well, uh, they implemented dark mode on their website. Um, this is kind of an interesting update because, well, a lot of things right now are running dark mode. And uh, the follow-up here is some update to the dark mode. So, uh, I'm just going to quickly cover what this is in general. Uh, dark mode is a mode on your website or page or whatever it is that makes things a bit darker. Here on EQD, you can change the settings via this gearbox here and set the theme to, well, in my case, it follows the browser slash system or I could just turn it to basic. This is how Equestria Daily looks like normally. And this is how it looks like with dark. And you know, honestly, I like dark mode better because it doesn't really flash out at you. And I, I guess you can clearly tell by looking at this here, because yay, um, Equestria Daily is so bright; it makes me light up on the camera. If I'm in um, dark mode, it lessens the burden and so on. <coughs> so yeah, um, dark mode is pretty cool and. With the recent iOS 13 update, it got an its dark mode too, finally. And with Windows recent update, it also got its dark mode ability turned on. So, I think the trend for... <coughs> <coughs> Sorry. <coughs> Sorry. Um, I think the trend for 2019 is dark mode. Dark mode everywhere. And yeah, um, dark mode is pretty cool. Dark mode is pretty cool. So, with that, um, that's the news for this week. So, um, what have I been doing with my week? For what have I been doing with my week? Um, 
<coughs> sorry. I, I I think I can say that I spent Friday hanging out with friends. Uh, we just went to a mall, just walking around trying to find Reese's Pieces cereal. Like I I heard they were around, but I couldn't find them. So me and my friends were trying to look for them. Unfortunately, we didn't manage to find them, which was unfortunate. But besides the point, oh sorry, besides that, uh, we came to my place to hang out, and we did a bit of chatting. Uh, we did a bit of uh, board games and whatnot. You know, just for the funsies. And yeah, we we had lunch. Um, if you were wondering what we were eating, just pizzas and stuff. You know, pizzas because. Pizza is one of those foods where it's party food, yo. So yeah, that's about it. And besides that, um, things have been going slowly, slowly. Personally, for me, um, things could be better. But hey, I'm not complaining, and I'm pretty okay. I'm pretty okay. I mean, things could be better. That's why I said things could be better. I hope next week will be a lot of funs. Uh, let's see. Next, yeah, I'm. I'm expecting a package to come next week and it's a communal package where some friends of mine uh, chipped in to buy a few stuff online so it helps with the uh, shipping costs because like I mentioned before importing anything from outside your own country is going to be a bit expensive it will be a lot easier if you could have a bunch of people chipped in and fortunately for me i have a few friends who wanted to buy stuff on a website and we all chip in in shipping and everybody's happy so hey that's awesome that's awesome <coughs> and besides that if you're wondering uh why i'm coughing still uh, that's because well um i still have the coughs um things have not been <laughs> kind I probably should go visit the doctor again but man visiting the doctor here is a bit challenging or a bit annoying see uh, unlike certain countries like the UK or Canada we don't really have free well I'd be lying because we have we, we do have government uh, health services where we pay a buck or two for their services but with that you have to wait a long time just to get to a doctor now for me I go to my local physicianist and um, every time I go to them I have to pay 60 bucks so yeah yeah and with how I was before I went to the doctor that was about three weeks ago probably and I'm still coughing <laughs> oh boys so but anyway um, that's besides the point <coughs> I'll probably get better soonish enough I, I hope I get better by the start of October mm -hmm. but yeah uh, that's me for well this this week I um, hope next week gonna be a lot better be a lot more uh, pleasant and let's just hope that next week is going to be awesome for everyone so anywho um let's wrap it up if you guys have any questions concerns or suggestions or suggestions for the show you can contact us at the com. you can also reach us on the twitters the show's twitter account is at the show and my personal twitter account is at norman sanzo and please subscribe me radios on itunes youtube don't forget to press the bell icon to stay up to date <coughs> Uh, Stitcher Radio and also like our Facebook page you can also catch us on PonyWithLive.com the links are in the show notes <coughs> sorry <coughs> oh boys um, also please subscribe and rate us on iTunes and Stitcher Radio o over there you'll catch us which is me Silver Quill Sephir Heart Song and also Totera reviewing the Pony comics episodes and special sometimes we like to do other things other than ponies and those things are animes the animes that we're doing right now is My Little Witch Academia. Um, that's a pretty fun show and I highly recommend you go check it out. Um, I think what next 
week or two weeks from now for the YouTubes, you'll be catching up with episode three of our review. So yeah, um, we're going at it slowly, at a, at a snail's pace. Not because we don't want to review it fast. We have ponies to cover first. Ponies first. <coughs> So anyhow, um, if you would like to support the show, you can do so at patreon.com. With every support, you get a week's early access to the review and discussion podcast. Sorry. <laughs> Exclusive and deleted content. And a huge thank you from me. Talking about thank yous, I would like to thank Amy, Lucky Knight, myself, Lag, Tristan, and also Jeffrey. Thank you so much, guys. You are great. So anyway, uh, <coughs> I have been Norman Sanzo. And I'll guys catch you next week with another fun episode of the MBS show. See ya!